everybody. Welcome to another episode of Tranny and C. I'm Tranny. This is C. Uh, we are pretty pumped about this month. Yeah, we are sponsored for all of October by Stacy Kyle, Lionheart Spirits, and the uh, Douglas Lang lineup. Yes. Um, and today we have the Scallywag Limited Edition um, BC Explorers. One of six hundred bottles. That's amazing. So this isn't just the uh, the regular the, old. The regular old scallywag. No, this is uh, one as as you said, one of six hundred bottles for British Columbia. Um, There's scallywag himself. This is uh, natural color, non chill filtered, bottled at forty. Is this eight. Forty eight percent. Forty eight percent. Wow. <laughs> and That's why don't you cool. tell us uh, what this is? It's a blended malt. So it's a blended malt, so it's, uh, for those who do not know, that basically means it is a bunch of single malts in one blend together. Um, and so this is Marriage of Scotch whiskeys exclusively from the Speyside region, including Macallan, Mortlach, and Glenrothes. Oh, that is very cool. Um, and so we, and we are gonna do our initial pop here. Initial pop, um, and this is going to be sent to all of our Dram Club members for the month of October. So if you want to join Dram Club, go to Patreon.com/slash Trendy and uh, and then join our Dram Club tier. A uh, quiet on set. There we go. There we go. Ooh, a little squeak pop. pop. Little, I like the squeak. Yeah. Um, beauty. Okay, cool. Look at the color on that. That's really yeah, nice. It's got this kind of like dark, uh, coppery yeah, it's kind quite of coppery, almost Copper like um, brownish. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they say it's all in the water for the whiskey. It's all if it's a brown, yeah, the brown extra brown. Then... Okay, this is our first. This is our first dive Dabble. into this uh, particular particular uh, version of a Douglas Lang. Okay, cool. Let's do it. Oh, nice nose. Oh, wow, yeah. That has that such like a traditional kind of style, you know? Like that is very, it's so stupid, but it's very scotchy. Tis, um, and to be more specific, <laughs> to be more specific, like quite big um, sherry fruit nose yeah, on it. I'm getting like a... Like a biscuity, raisiny kind of plummy, and, even. But there's some nice, like, um, um, like cinnamon type baking spice, and like maybe even like a nutmeg kind of thing going on in there. Like, there's some real nice, like, oven. you know, when you kind of get those, uh, have you seen those oranges that have the cloves pressed into them? Yeah, I know what you're talking like about. That yeah. kind of, I get a bit clovey of that. orange, yeah. The old clovey orange, I think, is what you're looking for. <laughs> that's what they call them, like, if you're looking online. Well, that's... That's that's interesting. I think you could spend some time on that. Now. Yeah, this, but this that is, is time to develop, I think. I don't know what the... Like, but that's booming. Like, there's a lot... It's very fragrant. Very fragrant nose. Oh, it's... Very it's, nice. It's still just kind of, like, opening up. I think like, we should taste it and then come back to the nose. Okay. Ready? And this one was... Some vanillas, like classic flavors in there. Um, wasn't this this one, one, I don't think it has an age statement on it. Oh, that was it. Yeah. Okay, that was the other one. I was looking for it. Okay, let's give it a taste. Yeah. Can we taste that? Sure. Here we go. Oh. Wow. To me, that is like the... The fruit level up front, or at least the sweetness anyways, is uh, quite up front. But I am really hit by like the forward, up front baking spice characteristic. Like to me, there was a ton of that, like almost even like, not in like a fireball kind of way, but almost like a cinnamon heart kind yep. of a thing going on. Um, really like- This is a Christmas classic. It, the, you know what? And he almost kind of has like a scarf on, like a little bit of a Christmas scarf. Like, I could see this being like a Christmas morning dram. Yeah. Um, the the style of sherry on it isn't, you know, the the baseball glove leather style, or even like really 
musty necessarily, but it's. But you, okay, but just to no. go back to what you said about the nose, like in a lot of ways, this palette does match the nose quite a bit, and that clovey orange, it's like liquefied now. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. I think this is one that I'm gonna have, we're gonna have to take some our time with because uh, it's hard to wrap your head around every little note that's coming out. It's even like. When I was a kid, my mom would make this stewed rhubarb that yeah. had like orange and clove in it. Yeah. And like to me, this is this is stewed rhubarb like childhood memories. Yeah, for sure. Rushing in. I don't <laughs> this know. Is I get a counseling it. session in a glass. Yeah. yeah. But you know what? Revisiting, I'm getting sherry leather. Revisiting the nose, sherry leather. Seriously. Okay. This one could we could spend some time, but I don't think. <clears throat> I don't want to think we want to waste everybody's time. The point is, this is like really good and there's so there's much going on. Yeah. Um, an exciting dram. I think we're lucky to have it. One of 600 bottles. Uh, BC Liquor Store um, exclusive. Going to be fun. Cool. If you're interested in trying it, patreon.com slash trendync. Um, check out the BC Liquor Store um, release. I'm sure that's oh, where yeah. it's coming in. Probably, yep. Yeah. First week of probably November. Yeah, um, first Saturday. Click like, subscribe, leave a comment. Cheers, everybody.